Just as school got underway Tuesday morning, hundreds of Whittemore Elementary students were bused to McDevitt Middle School after a gas leak was detected at their school. These photos show kids and school officials gathered outside in freezing cold temperatures getting ready to be moved to McDevitt. But by day's end, the situation had turned into a great example of cooperation among city departments. Waltham School Superintendent Drew Eccleson said custodians noticed a gas odor in the basement around 7.45 a.m. Whittemore Principal Emma Herzog immediately called 911. A slight odor of gas with the uh, readings on carbon monoxide meters at a relevant 150. For comparison, a uh, residential uh, carbon monoxide detector goes off at about uh, 35. There were approximately 35 to 40 people evacuated. No one was injured and no students were inside the school at the time. The majority of kids walked to Whittemore. Students who didn't immediately return home with parents were bused to McDevitt, fed, and kept busy until their parents picked them up. Three reverse 911 calls and an email updated parents and requested they pick up their kids as soon as possible. Principal Herzog said the majority of kids were home from McDevitt by noon, with only a couple left by the end of the school day at 3 p.m. Any parents who went to Whittemore were met by Spanish-speaking teachers. As for the cause of the leak, Eccleson said a fan in the boiler room was not ventilating exhaust properly. The problem was fixed and now the school is safe, with school returning to normal Wednesday morning. Eccleson commended an extraordinary effort by all the city officials involved. For Waltham Newswatch, this is Chris Wangler.